welcome back to another <laughs> dude you ruined it i just felt like i was super ugly so i changed my look i dude you ruined it uh hey guys welcome back to another episode of cardboard craft okay guys i know what you're thinking you're like whoa dude Ua just totally changed on me i did i've been taking this quarantine time to just really reflect on myself and i feel like i just had a mini glow up am i right i kind of grew my hair a little bit i shrunk a little bit okay actually i shrunk a lot of it and uh, my face shape changed to my jawline you see it's like small it's weird dude but it's sick so uh yeah and i just thought i'd point that out so let's get on to today's episode yeah let's go <laughs> but today we're doing a super cool project again of course obviously gonna make uh some street signs for a friend of mine whose birthday was like one two three like three or four months ago um a little bit of a late birthday gift but uh gotta keep my promises and also need content so here we go. Also, I'm making a one-way sign and a 35 mile per hour sign. That is something that you should know. Need content? More like, need cardboard. Hi, poopy head. She called me a fart face, that's rude. So I have all the materials I need, but I don't have the measurements. It's time to go on a field trip. I found a speed limit sign. There's so many cars. It's 30 by 24 inches. That's not a one-way sign. That's not a one-way sign. That's not a one-way sign. It's time to go on a bike ride to find a one-way sign because there's not any very close to my house. Wear a helmet. Room, room, kiddos. Bingo. 12 by 36. I'm back. Let's, um, let's cut some, some street signs out of cardboard. This cardboard is not big enough. This cardboard is the right size. Go the speed limit, kids. Okay, I am a little disappointed that there are all these crease lines and a couple dent marks, but hopefully paint will sort of help hide that. I don't know. But there's not much I can do. This is the only piece of cardboard that is the right size. However, the corners of street signs are round. Time to cut some corners. <laughs> In retrospect, it probably would have been easier just to draw on the curved corners when I had drawn it onto the box. It doesn't matter though. Then I need to cut out one more sign and I'm not gonna make that mistake again. There's one way to do this. <laughs> I'm so fun. Nice time again. Ah! Awesome. Okay, so now comes the fun part, and that's painting with spray paint, because this is a lot of space. Here's one problem. It is... Hey Siri, what's the humidity outside right now? The humidity is currently 86%. Hey spray paint can, what does humidity need to be below 65%? Do I care? No, it's always a million percent humidity here, so we're just gonna go for it. Beans. Cardboard. On cardboard. On more cardboard. That was just the first coat of primer. It's gonna take a while. Primer coat two. Top coat number one. Clean out your spray paint cans, kids. This is half a can of wasted spray paint. That means these things are stuck in the primer phase for now. I made a Home Depot run. Top coat number one. Top coat number two. So I think it's safe to say that those two are done being painted white. Yeah, it's good. Now onto like the, the black parts of it. Yeah. 
Jenna's back. Um, so it's currently 10 o'clock. You know what time that is? It's time to keep on cardboard crafting, my dudes. Let's paint the signs. Hey! <laughs> Okay, I don't know if you can really see it, but um, this is all very complicated to get all the proportions right and everything, because if I want to get the proportion, I got to measure everything. There's a lot of math involved in this. Whew. And artistic skill. <laughs> I mean, yep. Yeah. One way, one way. Now it's nighttime painty paint time. I made an oopsie. I was supposed to record a time lapse of me painting all that, but I forgot to hit start. Okay, I'm very happy with how this one came out. I think I might give it a clear coat still because the white paint <clears throat> or glossy clear coat because the white paint is um glossy and the black paint is like a matte finish. I still got to do this one. But it's midnight so um we're going to bed. See you all in the morning. Good morning. Actually, it's 12.45, but, um, you get the point. So, uh, now it's time to draw some stuff. Say it looks pretty good. I don't know if you guys can see it, but, uh... Oh, no, you can't. But now you can. Painty time! So now these signs are done, but the black paint is like matte black. And the white stuff is glossy and like, you know, if you're driving on the road at night and you shine your headlights at the uh, signs, they like reflect back in your eyes and you're like, ah, I can't see. Well, that's kind of what I want these to be like. So I need to put some gloss finish. Okay. I'll see you in like 10 seconds. I did it. They're shiny. They're done. They look amazing. Um, now I have to give them to her, but I'm going on like a little sort of vacation thing uh, this week and I want to get the video out. Wait a second. I, so I've already gone on vacation. Um, the Wi-Fi was too slow at the place where we were, so I wasn't able to edit. So now you actually do get to watch her see the signs. This thing. Cool, it's that here. I am in the car. Vroom vroom. I've arrived. Oh my god, that's <laughs> enormous. <laughs> Made them full size and everything, so. Oh my, this is full size? Yes, that is. Full size. What do you think? It's ridiculous and I love it. <laughs> I'm glad. Thank you. Yeah, no problem. Don't. I am. Say hi to the camera. Hi. Mission accomplished. She liked them. Well, the floor is pretty comfortable. So I think I'll just wrap up the video from down here. Um, uh, I think of a good pun. Now that this video is over, you need to zoom one way at about 35 miles an hour towards the like and subscribe button. Basically what I'm trying to say is, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.
Woo-hoo! <laughs>